believe you guys would have got some material they have sent you okay so uh, now whatever is okay i'll come back to the material uh, my name is sai i'm a cs by education and uh, a teacher by profession i've been into teaching for the last 7 uh, years and uh, i have been teaching law for all the professional courses so far so that is about me i've done cs and llb and uh, currently into full time teaching yes ha so that is about me uh, there is nothing much probably i might look a little unconventional teacher a little i know <laughs> so the this beard is a part of my life so I accept it <laughs> so that's about me and uh, with regards to law you guys will be getting uh, two kind of materials one is the textbook whatever has already been sent to you the second one will be writing uh, notes in the class yeah and uh, the same thing only we call it as a, a summary chart the summary chart which is in a digital form which will be available on the website which even can be placed as an order as well but for you guys i would not recommend if you guys are already part of the class we'll be writing more about whatever is there in the books over and above whatever is there we'll be writing in the class only but i'm just telling somewhere somewhere down the line you feel that uh, i've missed something i want to have a quick copy of the entire book i'm telling you that will be somewhere available you guys can place a order for it but if you guys are part of the class regularly you would not need that summary chart book because it will be covered inside the class itself that's the point number 1 uh point number 2 uh whenever the class is going on one thing i'll tell you uh, we'll be a little flexible i'll not say that uh, you'll be you have to attend the class at 4:15 only 4:15 is a class timings i'll be starting the class at 4:15 you guys might have colleges you guys might have other commitments going on in life so because of some reason if at all there is any delay in coming back i mean coming to the class do not stop yourself from coming whatever is the time feel free to come yes but that's that's a responsibility i'm giving you guys between what is genuine and what is that you are taking it for taken it for granted so from my end my only intention is we'll be meeting here for 20 25 days in the 25 days whatever we'll be meeting for make sure that you try to get the maximum out of it there will be days where uh, you will not be able to make up to the class but even if it is like last 2 hours 3 hours whatever is left if you feel like you can attend then please feel free to attend the time should not be the barrier as i said the responsibility is on you i am giving it for you as a flexibility use it as a flexibility only but not as a granted one clear am okay uh, third one people uh, try to finish the subject with me now if at all i am finishing the first chapter even for you guys you will have to finish the first chapter if at all i am going to the next chapter try to go it along with me so if at all we are learning the concepts today in the class once you guys go home it will take hardly half an hour one hour to just recollect whatever we have done for the day but if you just leave a couple of days now whatever we have done you need to reinvent the wheel in the class you would have already learnt everything if you just go home it is a revision but after a week or after 5 6 days what is going to happen you would have missed it out people you need to relearn the concept because the concept will fade away we have a very kutti brain it will not store a lot of memory and you know how our brain is developed right there is a existing memory tomorrow's class will overwrite today's class you have to make sure you store it as early as possible before some other memory erases it off so your duty every day no matter what just try to spend that one hour make sure you guys are reading whatever is done in the class every day make it a habit clear all of you okay next one i don't know fourth thing or fifth thing uh, will be uh, i'll be giving you assignments probably not the first two days or something but going forward probably from the third day or something like that you guys will be getting three questions as assignments every day three questions as assignments every day but are you guys okay to write the assignments and all they back benchers so nee velbeku avaru baritara you they will write uh, the back benchers is what will miss out so are you guys okay writing the assignments 
all of you yes, but assignments and all come with the rule people now what is the rule people the rule is simple what is the rule what is the rule if at all don't write don't come allah if you don't write the entire class will lose out on assignments going forward so even if one person people you guys can be 100 here even if one person misses out writing an assignment the assignments will be discontinued forever so that one person you know that one person will take the responsibility of taking away the assignment thing from the entire class so if you can live with that guilt then you can take up this assignment part okay na hello sound kar me <laughs> sound reduced oh my god we have just started rules are it to come okay, okay sir. sure yes, sir. pakka remember you are only telling re, pakka and all but tomorrow day after tomorrow you guys only will come and say sir please sir something happened sir i missed out sir you guys only come up with this 100% it will happen again i am asking you only if you are okay with this we'll start we'll start ha pakka sure why i am telling you people always remember uh, see if i just tell you to write assignments there will be some uh, you will feel hey, what is there in this or you will not go to that extra mile you will not be able to understand the question on day one remember i'll not judge you it is only for you to understand what type of questions will come in the exam why to go to the exam hall and understand what type of questions will come at that day at that point of time try to write as many questions as possible throughout the class you will be seasoned by the time you guys go to the exam right that fear of writing will come down remember people law will be in your degree they will generally say dsp what is dsp in in degree words they say no this paper is a dsp so dsp devesh prasad not devesh prasad da dsp is what they generally say right it's a degree stopping paper they generally say have you heard of it okay for all there is a paper which is tricky at the same time good you use a word called dsp dsp means it can be a degree stopping paper it can also be a degree scoring paper trust me you guys will score really good in law and it will help you to match your aggregates 100% no one will sit in a professional course and tell you this i am telling you you guys will really score good in law it will help you to match your aggregates i am telling you day one provided do what i am telling you to do you don't have to do extra also just do what i am telling you to do is this clear now it is your responsibility to make sure whatever is given you guys are doing it properly so in the part of this learning only is your assignments imagine people will be meeting for let us imagine 25 days three questions a day let us imagine we just give the assignments for 20 days isn't 60 questions of writing practice really good enough to test your knowledge on how you are doing and what you are doing it will make sure that whether the concepts you guys are understanding is it right are you able to interpret it back and second thing people always remember law is more of writing what you have it in mind you guys will have the answer are you able to write it on the paper it won't come try to see whether a formal writing comes now we will have informal writing when you are writing the answer also now generally students will come and say sir i really wrote it well sir i didn't know what happened if you see actually it will be a informal communication like you are speaking with friends now how do you develop this habit by writing so assignments are something which make sure that you guys are on track is this clear all of you yes okay third thing people as and when some sizable content is done whenever we have a, a day off or something uh, i'll be giving you guys tests to write and i'm telling you all of this apart from what uh, the academy has told you whatever they have they'll be conducting them uh, test series and all i think they would have conveyed also whatever i'm telling you is nothing to do with what academy has told you that they'll be doing what i'm telling you what i'll be doing i getting the point so when i say i will give you that test i will make sure that is getting corrected i getting the point so as and when some sizable content is done after if we get to know if there is a day off or something so those days be prepared you guys will have a test it is a point 
and nowhere people even if you get zero on 25 or 50 whatever we are having the marks for nowhere i would be judging you remember nowhere even if you give a wrong answer i'll come and say you are not doing right i'll not say you that at all it is just for our self realization that's all is this clear so if at all you have this uh, mindset where i have not prepared so i wish i should not write this i'll give you an assignment i did not understand that's why i did not write don't do that if at all i have given you an assignment that means that concept would have been discussed in the class so try it imagine if a question comes in your exam for which you were not prepared how would you face it in the same way you need to face this also is clear all of you pakka yes okay now whatever this i am telling you this is only for the recorded videos uh, students if you guys have any doubt first thing make sure that you watch the entire video because your question definitely would be coming from this 100 people somewhere someone would be asking 100% so watch the classes throughout watch that video throughout your question will be answered for sure first one second thing if you guys have a question make sure you give me a context of the question like you are asking from which topic or which page number so you you try to give me a context of the question you are asking just do not uh, uh, you i mean not everyone few people will ask like uh, you know law right i'll be telling you people this is how it will happen and you know how the questions will come sir what if it did not happen see for you you are in the context you know what you are reading i do not know what you are reading what if it is not like that i do not know what is happening so make sure you give me some context of what you are studying so that even i'll also understand which topic is uh, you know you're trying to uh, figure out so that's the third thing and the fourth thing people whenever i will be answering your questions i'll be answering your doubts for that do not reply uh, don't say thank you don't say anything for that do not reply uh, i'll tell you the reason for that also now whenever you guys will reply imagine that doubt will go back to some 30th page or 40th page for me it would pop up as a question only i need to go back to that 40th page and i, I need to search where your uh, you know your comment is coming so if it's solved it's solved you need not have to say thank you don't say anything so keep these things in mind uh, and uh, if there is anything else i'll be telling you guys throughout the class is it clear all of you and one more thing now you guys will be uh, you will be seeing this materials you would have got the material also here and there there can be some questions which i would have taken i i don't know if you guys have seen now uh, in the material you guys will be having this uh, so you guys will have something like this called practice questions given in your material itself itself so these questions are taken from your past question papers or rtps or previous attempts paper all those thing questions have been put in your material itself now there can be one or two questions where we would have taken the questions from 2021 or 22 attempt that would have been there in your question that is that is in your book we would have seen an amendment provision in the class also but the answer can be the old provision that scenario may come so if at all i have told you an amendment in the class try to answer the question as per the amendment it can happen for you guys also we would have discussed some topic there can be a question which is a past question 90% of the questions i would have filtered but even i am a human there can be an error some answers would be according to the past syllabus only there are some amendments that would have happened i wouldn't have changed it so if at all that such questions come we will be discussing the provisions i believe you guys can handle the answers is clear ha pakka all of you yes anything else i think that's it that should cover most of it okay uh can we take the print out of the book sent us sent to us ha uh, whatever you guys got it today you guys can take a print out of it yes class test will be conducted for online students also i'll be giving you the question paper you guys can take it up because uh, or else if you guys are in bangalore only feel free to come and write that can also be accommodated that also you guys can do clear ha yes ha okay and uh, the main rule the last rule of the class people what all of you take your phones take your phones take your phones yes sir i think you guys would have put your phones on silent mode 
put it on general mode. Okay. Put it on general mode. No, why? Oh, yeah. So, you guys know the rule. What is the rule? If at all people, phone rings, phone makes noise, it can be an alarm, it can be a message. Remember people, the day will come where your friend only will take your phone. He will put it, she will put it on general mode. Promise on you, every batch the case will come. Yes, sir. So, keep your objects in your responsibility. Whatever happens, it is your phone only. Your friends will come up with a master plan and all. It will happen, 100%. Yes, sir. If at all anything happens, anything, anything, I wouldn't have covered some scenarios also. If anything happens, people, you will have to sing a song. <laughs> yes, sir. We have already our seniors who would have sung some good songs. Yeah, we expect more songs from you. <laughs> so, all of you are okay with this? Yes, sir. Hello, song or All of you are okay with this? Okay, na? Okay. Remember people, sir, I don't know the lyrics. <laughs> sir, I'm not feeling well. Sir, I don't know to sing. All these are not valid excuses. Clear? Huh? Yes, sir. Tell the... Yes, sir. So, all the phones are in general mode. Huh? Why? Huh? Disappointing. Okay. So, last one people, my phone may ring. <laughs> yes, so my phone may ring. That rule is obviously not applicable. Now I'll tell you one more rule. When my phone rings, anyone who asks me to sing will sing a song. <laughs> yes, sir. Remember, this day also will come. <laughs> Clear all of you? Yes. So, this is something which will have uh, some other part of the elements of the class also. So, that's the only intention. But whenever your turn comes, do make sure that you abide by the condition. Clear? Huh? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, should we study from ICI study material as well? Obviously, people, if at all you have to study from both the materials, I wouldn't have signed my material also. Uh, see, I'll tell you one thing. When whatever is the material I have given to you, uh, that is 100% whatever is there in your book, it will be the same concepts that will be, see end of the day it is law, I cannot write my own context in uh, my book, that is not possible. Even ICAI has taken from the act only, even I have also taken from the act only. So there is nothing that uh, ICAI material will have or uh, my material will have in, in excess of what is required. Just that, now whenever you are seeing my book, you guys can find such things called as practice questions or somewhere you can see. So these topics will be added and you know probably some 2-3 MCQs would be added. If a paragraph is very lengthy, probably I would have given you the synopsis of that paragraph as I follow something called as in short. So such things also you may see. So these are some things which I have tried to implement in my book. I cannot say you, you do not study ICAI material. But I am saying this material is also sufficient. Now as I told you, we will be having two materials. One you will be writing down everything. When I say everything, we will be literally writing down everything. This will be the most, uh, you know, useful, useful to 100%. Huh? See, every one people, what did we learn from our uh, World Cup, da? the recent World Cup, not this World Cup. Not the boring World Cup. I am talking about that interesting World Cup. Yeah, you may study for the six months, but the last day matters a lot. Yeah, so that last day, this book will act as a, whatever you guys can call it. It will help you to revise all the concepts in a very crisp way. So for that people, whatever we are writing will help you a lot. The second thing is whenever other subject is started or other subject is going on, if you want to quickly revise, this will again help you to quickly revise whenever the other subjects are going on. So that is something which this uh, summary charts will help you for. So keep that in mind. Clear all of you? Yes. Okay. Huh. Okay. Is this clear? Huh? Things are clear. Okay, done. So we'll start with your uh, law. 
what is there, what is not there, what type of questions will come, uh, pattern, how many marks, 30, 30, yeah. 30, 70, so we will see all this in our first part only, so that uh, that part is clear, okay, huh. okay. Awesome. First of all, yes, the whoever have cleared uh, CA Foundation have come. Very nice. So big uh, congratulations to all of you. Nice. For whosoever have already cleared your one module or the other, anyone who has cleared something in uh, CA Inter? Okay. Uh, anyone who has written up uh, the previous attempt and all? Okay. How did it go? Okay. Okay, okay, done, done. So, uh, okay, for whosoever you guys have written attempt, wish you guys the best for your results. Let's hope for the best. Okay, so this is your law paper, people. We have uh, technically 100 marks. 70 marks is your part A. Part A will be completely company law. In company law, we have around uh, 11 units. And uh, the 12th chapter is a different act that is called as LLP Act. In your CA Foundation, you would have seen something of basics of LLP Act also. We will be seeing a little more concepts of LLP Act here. And the Part B people is other laws. Three chapters, FEMA is the major part. I hope you guys know that uh, some parts have been taken from CA Final and they have put it in CA Inter. The two chapters such they have done that is your uh, uh, foreign companies, that is your uh, 11th chapter and uh, your FEMA, 13th chapter, I mean 15th chapter. So these two chapters have been taken from CA final and they have introduced it in your CA inter. Why is this important people? Remember as the attempts go by, that's okay. It will become a standardized format. But in the new attempts people, one, two, three attempts, whenever the new concepts or new chapters have taken, the chances of questions being asked from these chapters are more. So remember, whenever I'm giving you some questions for FEMA or uh, for, uh, uh, what is that, uh, companies incorporated outside India, I might be giving you some more advanced questions also. Because we already have CA final papers, we know what type of questions may come. It might be a little advanced for you guys, but it is good to do a little more than to do under. So it is always good to cover more concepts only. So I'll be doing a little more only with regards to FEMA, FEMA as well. FEMA is very important for us. Is this clear all of you? At least for the next one or two attempts. After that, it will go with the trend. We will have your past uh, patterns and all. It will not make much of difference as well. So this will be your format. One is 70 and 30. And uh, with regards to what type of, uh, is it your descriptive paper or uh, is it a multiple choice? You have a combination and uh, how much is of MCQ? 30 marks is MCQ. Do you have negative marking? No, so there are some two FAQs which is important for you. The second FAQ will be important. Is there negative marking? This was given in your ICI brochures and uh, this part only. It says that there is no negative marking. So you know now that is your forte KGF Rocky by only. Uh, inky pinky ponky something as a donkey. You will have to write everything. <laughs> You should not leave even a single question. That's why I told you, law will be your scoring paper. On an average, I'm telling you people, 55 to 58 is an average score I'm seeing in the students whom I teach. 55 to 58. When I say average, I'm saying take everyone divided by number of students. So I'm telling you the average is 55-58. If you guys can even uh, concentrate uh, to your best and if you can give, uh, you know, even at least like 100% of what you guys can do. You guys can easily score 60 or above in law. Easily manageable. 100% possible. And trust me, it will help you a lot for your aggregate. 100%. You guys will pakka pass. That though, don't even bother. You will pakka pass. Law, your, your thought should never be for 40 Pakka aim it for 60, 65 because this is the paper you are writing for matching your aggregates. Are you in the point? All of you? 100%? Okay, done. So this will be your format and this is your marks. So that is something which you guys need to know. 
So once we know that, let us come back to your uh, syllabus. Okay, how many questions? What type of questions? You know how many questions will be there? Okay, as we said, the format is 100 marks paper. This will be divided into 30 and 70. 30 people is your MCQ and 70 people is your descriptive. Yes, and in MCQ people, you can have uh, two types of questions. One, you will have a single one mark based questions, which is very easy to handle. So you may have around, uh, uh, you know, you will have one mark questions also that is there. You will also have two marks questions also. This will be a little tricky to handle because these will be case based questions. The problem with case based questions, I'll tell you. Even though you will feel that, uh, you know, I have 30 MCQs, I can uh, approach it with, uh, you know, a lot. Probably you will have time benefit is what you guys will think. But remember the MCQs will take a lot of time of yours because in MCQs, they will ask you a case based scenarios to give you an example. Uh, I think the first uh, chapter only we had something. Uh, see, this is an MCQ. They will not ask you something directly. They will be a scenario. You need to analyze the scenario. Now this is easily hand. I mean, you can handle this uh, a little easily only because it's around four or five lines, but there will be questions where uh, the questions will be for seven lines, eight lines, such questions will be there. That will be a little tricky to handle. That will be for two marks. I guess getting the point. Huh? So you guys can see both type of questions also. One is uh, one mark questions. You'll see, you'll see two mark questions as well. And the next one is people descriptive. Totally, there will be six questions. In six questions, question one is compulsory. You, you have to write question one. And uh, the next five questions, you have an option to write four questions. You will have one option here. And there is no negative marking. And always I'm telling you, day one I'm telling you, when you're writing law paper, you will have a problem with completing the paper in three marks. It will be a little tough task only. So make sure time management is always good. Because if not, the maximum marks you will be able to cover will be 85 to 95. That's the maximum I generally hear. So time management will be very crucial. So make sure that is also taken care. These are maximum common mistakes all the students will do. Is clear all of you? Pakka? Yes? Okay, sir. So this is about your uh, basics people. Uh, now let us start your uh, okay. Huh. We'll see that. How to download the study material from the app? You will have a option to download only. There will be that download option. How do I say? Attachment. Like this. So that will be there. The notes will be helpful. Yes, 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 yes. We'll be covering all these people. I'll be telling you as we start the class also. Done now? Yes, sir. We'll cover it.